above all else, we are committed to the care and improvement, the care, care, care and improvement, and improvement of human, human life. life. My name is Kathy Botts. I'm Fitness Director at Extreme Fitness for Women and Extreme Health Club. My life changed on January 7th. That day was a normal day and I came in and was teaching a class on a Wednesday morning. And about 40 minutes into my class, um, I got a pain in the back of my head. Um, I barely, vaguely remember that pain being excruciating. And I do recall saying, give me just a second the next pain that I got took me to my face. Waking up at TriStar, my first thought was, how did I get here? I remember uh, the nurses being very, very uh, attentive. Um, I was very belligerent. I wanted to get up. That was my first thing. I, you know, I think they had to like strap me in the bed. And when I did try to get up, uh, out of the bed, we realized that my right leg was numb from the knee down. And that was a heart revelation for me. That was a hard day for me to accept that. The first time the doctor came in to see me after the surgery, what I remember is him telling me how extremely lucky I am to be here. Uh, and two, that I shouldn't be here. The nurses were very comforting. They, um, you, it's so embarrassing to go through what I went through. People are having to comb your hair and people are putting lotion on you and giving you a bath. And um, those kind of things are, um, those people are angels. From that first day that they allowed me to get out of the bed and um, onto a walker, I, I had to be taught how to utilize that walker. As a marathon runner, as a fitness person for 27 years, it was quite um, a hard pill to swallow to all of a sudden be on a walker. Things have changed for me dramatically, and I'm, I'm sad about that sometimes. I can't really complain. And once you have died and been brought back to life, you can never complain again. And um, you know, it's a it's a great excuse for not remembering somebody's name now. <laughs> Skyline was an answer of prayer the day that my aneurysm hit me. And I look back at what they did for me, and they truly are uh, gifts. If I can share one thing is how important their jobs are to make us feel like humans and not just a number. I never felt like a number while I was at Skyline. And I pass that hospital now on my trips back down to Nashville, and it's always a good memory because they, they saved my life.